Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. I'm going to do an unboxing on this Sony FDR AX53. It's my new video camera that I'm going to be using for taking videos, mainly of just airplanes when I'm at the airports taking videos. But, and I got this microphone to go with it and SD card. So the, bo the box is really small. I know this camera has been out for I think two or three years but just the reviews on it are just so good about the steady shot and I'm do I do a lot of handheld video on and this the steady shots what I'm really looking forward to okay, so you open it up you've got all the Sony stuff directions at least I give you a manual with it and cords. There's the battery, some more cords. Looks like they did give you a charger. Okay. But I think you use the camera to charge, which I don't like to do. That's why I've got I got this extra charger off of Amazon, which I did a separate review on it. Okay, so here's everything that comes in the box. Yeah, the charger looks like they want you to use the actual camera to charge, which is fine. Just not ideal and that's what the plug this plug is for this the charger hdmi to mini hdmi cable uh, micro usb c to usb and then the battery that's a sony battery that's probably the really good battery these generic ones just don't quite stack up to the actual sony battery but i think they'll get us by okay so the sony battery let's see if it charges Okay, it comes with 20% charge, not much charge, but it does charge in this generic charger. Okay, so it fits in my hand really well. I had to use, I got kind of a bigger hand and I had to loosen the Velcro quite a bit, but it fits just like I'm going to want. And the zoom is right there. Pretty standard camcorder setup. So one thing I noticed right away is that steady shot. That's lens is on a gimbal of some sort. I don't have it powered up right now, but you can really tell it's it's moving around. So one thing I was really concerned about was the eyepiece. Now I read reviews that you can't get your face next to it because the battery sticks out so much. But so I have glasses and the eyepiece is pretty much you it's really hard to use this is really hard so your glasses kind of you know it's not soft like a camera it has like a soft eyepiece this is really hard and it feels awkward up against your glasses and then it's just got a really small screen inside there so we'll play around with it some more uh everybody says the that this works fine in sunlight because i'm going to be outside taking uh, videos at airports so they say this works really well in the sun I'll, I'll give that a try but this is just the first unboxing I was really wanting to see how the eyepiece was I really want to use the eyepiece but I may not have to I'll let you know so here's the here's the side of it it's got this little door that looks like it takes a standard SD card um, you're going to you're going to want to make sure the door you close the door I think there is a little switch on there I know I had another camcorder that it wouldn't read the SD card until the door was closed. So just make sure you close the door. It's got a nice little spring action to it. It's like a little door for the micro HDMI out. Okay, so it does have this really nice touchscreen. It's kind of small, but it is super, it is responsive. And you got I walked it through setting up the time and the time zone was really easy to set up. So there's the hot shoe. Um, this is plastic. It just pops open. And it looks like it does kind of fold up out of the way. Looks like we got another little door there. Okay, that's the micro USB port and the microphone port. So that's a nice little door. And that's made, that's made very well. It just pops out of the way. And it's got on the bottom the tripod mount. And it does have this hole in front of the tripod mount. It's got this 
manual button here I'm not sure what that's about and up here underneath the hand strap is a headphone jack out that door is a little harder to open but and kind of hidden when it's powered off it does have a screen shutter but you can touch it so I might buy a um, protective piece of glass there to protect and as soon as you either pull the eyepiece out or open the LCD side door the it comes off or the lens cover comes off and then you can red lights flashing I'm not sure I think it's recording no no it's not recording I'm not sure why the red light was flashing so on the top this is the built-in um, microphone and then it does have like another button here looks like you can use it to take pictures or something or there's a photo button too but not sure what that is and then that's the standard record start stop okay there's the DC in so that's where you would charge the battery and yep that's where you charge the battery I got the door open Okay, so I've got the charger plugged in. Like I said, this is the one that comes with it. It's this little adapter that plugs into your wall. And that's what it looks like when it's charging. Okay, so I put the SD card in. Uh, one thing I did notice is it powers on every time you open the LCD. And it powers off every time you close it. So just keep that in mind. I don't know if that's a setting you can change or not. And once I installed the SD card, that red light stopped flashing. So I'm not recording or nothing. Okay, everyone, this was just an unboxing of the camcorder Sony AX53. I'm going to do another video of the microphone I bought above. And I'm going to do a bunch of videos because I'm going to use this mic this um, camcorder for plane spotting. And I'm going to do some mods that I've been watching online. I'm going to try to modify the eyepiece. I'm going to try to modify put something on the shutter up front to help protect it better so i'm going to do some more videos uh, if you could please like and subscribe and thank you for watching